Hello viewers, today we will explore the smartest US presidents based on their IQ scores. While it's generally understood now that someone's intelligence can't be reduced to a number, IQ tests can still shine a light on the inner workings of someone's mind, especially if it's impossible to talk to them personally. It's only natural to wonder how figures from history would have scored, and considering the IQ test was only invented in 1905, that leaves quite a few historical figures to speculate on. In 2006, Dean Simonton, a professor of psychology at the University of California, Davis, let his curiosity get the best of him and conducted a study to assign IQ scores to all the US presidents from George Washington all the way up to George W. Bush. How do you think the presidents of the United States scored. Watch this video. Number 1. Gerald Ford Gerald Ford, the 38th President of the United States, had an IQ of 127.08. Not only did he study at and graduate from Yale Law School, but he did so while coaching the Yale varsity football team. Number 2. Calvin Coolidge, known affectionately as Silent Cal, the 30th President, had an IQ of 127.1. Revered for his belief in equal rights, but also blamed by some for setting the stage for the Great Depression, Coolidge graduated from Amherst College in Massachusetts with honors. Number 3. Harry Truman Although he had an IQ of 127.55, Harry Truman, the 33rd President of the United States, never received a college degree. Truman was, in fact, blind in one eye, which made it difficult for him to follow along, and he dropped out of college after just a year. Number 4. Lyndon B. Johnson Lyndon B. Johnson, who became the 36th president after the assassination of John F. Kennedy, had an IQ of 127.83 and was passionately studious all his life. After being elected president of his 11th eighth grade class, Johnson studied at what is now Texas State University and graduated with a teaching certificate and a bachelor's degree in history. Number 5. Herbert Hoover Herbert Hoover, while not particularly popular as the 31st president during the Great Depression, had been successful and industrious from a young age. Hoover, who had an IQ of 129.78 while studying geology at Stanford, created his own business on the side, taking care of fellow students' laundry. Number 6. Ronald Reagan Ronald Reagan, the 40th President of the United States, had an IQ score of 130. Despite his intelligence, Reagan wasn't particularly interested in school and graduated from college with a C average. Afterwards, Reagan pursued careers in radio and film before being drawn to politics. Number 7. George H. W. Bush William McKinley, the 25th and 41st Presidents, both had an IQ score of exactly 130.13, but their educations couldn't have been more different. McKinley only attended one year of college and chose instead to fight in the Civil War for the Union, while Bush graduated Phi Beta Kappa from Yale University in two and a half years, while also serving as president of his fraternity and captain of the baseball team. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating exploration of the IQ scores of some of the brightest minds to have led the United States. If you found this dive into presidential intelligence as intriguing as we did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you're the first to know when we release new thought-provoking content.